The boy collapsed outside these flats at quarter past 11 last night and then when police found him he was in cardiac arrest. Now he was taken to hospital but he died there a couple of hours later. Police believe that he'd been at a party and they say that he may have been drinking and also taking nitrous oxide which is a legal high known as laughing gas. Although it's important to point out that at this stage they are still treating his death as unexplained. However, people we've spoken here today say that it is common to see young people doing laughing gas in this area and there are several canisters littering the floors. Well, tell us a little bit more, Jean, about how widespread it is and, and clearly it's very dangerous. Yes, of course. It's, it's quite popular with teenagers at parties and festivals and reports suggest that its use is on the rise and it's usually inhaled through a balloon and it can make people feel relaxed and euphoric but it can also lead to oxygen deprivation, a loss of blood pressure and in some cases heart attacks and there have been warnings about the health of this drug particularly from local councils who are the ones dealing with it saying that this is a drug that can kill and that message needs to be out there but at this stage it is a legal high so it's not illegal to take it although it is illegal in England and Wales to sell it to people under 18 if there's a risk that they may inhale it however the government is looking to ban it more thoroughly as part of its plan to ban all legal highs.